In India, today, 58% of children do not complete primary school and 90% do not attend college. Of the children that do attend school, 90% of them go to government or government-aided schools. One of the greatest injustices is the sustained neglect of 1.2 million government schools. Which is just for girls, Narakawa, for uh, my plus one uh, education, and I'm here with a first year student. I want to build another house which satisfies all of our needs. Here we are having only two rooms, and in one room, four of us my mother, father, uh, me, and my sisters are uh, doing, and another room, my grandmother. The day India's children get a world class education will be the day India will become a superpower. The promoting regional schools to international standards through multiple interventions, PRISM project was initiated by the local MLA of Calicut, Pradeep Kumar, and taken to truly international standards with the involvement of the Faisal and Shabana Foundation. PRISM has done a complete overhaul of the 120-year-old Government Vocational Higher Secondary School for Girls, Nadakava, in Calicut, Kerala, in December 2013. Within a year of its transformation, the school is ranked among India's top five government schools and number one on the parameter of infrastructure provision by Education World India Schools Rankings 2014. PRISM is not just a project. It's a movement that aims to create a model for upgrading government schools to world standards. The initiative plans to upgrade 100 more schools in Kerala by 2020 and simultaneously expand the movement across India. Faisal and Shabana Foundation believe if we need to develop and progress the world, we need to bridge the gap between the have and the have nots. We invested 16 crore in a government school along with the government of Kerala to upgrade the school to an international standard. I believe if we can replicate this model into all the government schools in our country, India will progress very fast because the education will become equitable for the rich and the poor equally. The beautiful three-storied classroom complex houses spacious smart classrooms for fully equipped science laboratories, an atrium, a multi-purpose hall, 92 sparkling clean toilets, a 13,000 square foot indoor stadium accommodating basketball and badminton courts, spacious locker rooms and an 18,110 square foot astroturf playing field for athletics, football and hockey. The campus has 75,000 square feet of green landscape, a kitchen and dining hall where women from the local community work and can use the facilities after school hours. The PRISM project envisages uh, giving the best of the infrastructure facilities that you would see in any other private school. The teachers are provided uh, training by the IIM Kori Code and uh, also by other uh, trainers and facilitators. We do it at least once a quarter. And in addition, uh, students are given training for excelling well at the 10th and 12th grade. Not only that, uh, students who aspire for uh, uh, getting into entrances, like you know the uh, engineering and the medical entrances, they are also given special coaching. I feel so proud uh, to be a part of Student Police Cadet. And we serve the society through the traffic duties. Higher secondary section, we had uh, 94% pass and 24 full A+. Plus. This year we have set a target of 75 full, full A+, plus and 100% at the uh, higher secondary level. And at the high school level we have set a target of 100% pass with 60 full A+. Plus. This school uh, focuses on the uh, all-round development activities. This year I am participating in the uh, sub-district level youth festival and also I am writing the grade 5 examination of Trinity College of London. PRISM is uh, conceived as a very big transformational model uh, for the schools. We know that a large number of uh, uh, Indian students study in government schools. But if really well, India has to go ahead and uh, uh, make real mark in the global scenario, it's important that our school education has to be radically transformed. And uh, the Narakao school has shown that uh, if you have the right intent and right people, we can actually make changes. And I don't 
I don't think why that should not be replicated across the country. At the Faisal and Shabana Foundation, we pay special attention to best practices in education which support girls to enable and empower them to have equal access to services, opportunities, legal rights and personal freedom. I love my school very much and I wish that there were more schools like this. I need to stand in my own two feet and not get married yet. It's because I do, I need not want to depend on my parents even after growing up and also on my husband even after getting married. I want to be a IAS. My ambition is for uh, to be a psychologist. I want to become a police IPS officer. My ambition is to be a teacher. This school gives you a purpose larger than yourself. And now is the moment that this girl and all the 300 million girls say in voices loud that we are the future of India and we will build the nation.